brand new Firebase 19 has been released with some new features and changes. There will be a lot of changes, a lot of features and in this video, I'm going to show you how to install Firebase 19 to a PC. If you want to host your own website, you can try hosting, link will be given in the description. So first of all, you'll have to search Firebase download and here you'll find download Firebase, click on it. Now you'll have to click on Firebase for PC and here if you're using Intel 3rd Gen to 7th Gen processor then you'll have to click on here and if you're using Intel 8th Gen to 13th Gen processor then you'll have to download from there and if you're using AMD or Intel processor with AMD graphics card then you have to download from there. I have agent processor then I have to click here. Always I recommend official download. Just click on there and download will install it. Now you'll have to search for reviews from the very first link. A little bit and from here download the latest. When the download is completed, close your browser. Go to the download folder and here you'll find repos and firewalls. Now you'll have to insert a pen drive to PC minimum 8 gigabytes. Just open the repos, click on yes, click on yes. Now click on select, go to the download folder and select the firewalls, click on open. Now here, your pen drive will be automatically selected and here you'll have to click on start. But before starting, make sure that every data on your pen drive is backed up because in this process, you'll lose every data on your pen drive. Click on start, click on OK. Now you'll have to wait until the process is completed. When it's completed, it'll start ready. Click on close. Now, you will have to restart your PC and access the BIOS menu. To access the BIOS menu, you can refer this photo, otherwise you can search in Google. On the BIOS menu, you will have to disable this keyboard and now, you will have to access the boot menu. To access the boot menu, you can refer this photo, otherwise you can search in Google. Now, from the boot menu, you will have to select your USB and hit the arrow key. Now, in the screen, make sure that you have connected to the internet. Now, click on OK. Now you'll have to click on get started. If you want to try it first, you can click on try it first. And if you want to install Firewalls, then you'll have to click on here install Firewalls. Now click on next. Now, if you want to install single boot, you'll have to select full disk installation. And if you want to install dual boot or multi boot installation process will be for you. In this case, you'll have to select a multi boot installation and click on next. Now here, you'll have to select, now here you'll have to select where you want to install Firewalls. Here you'll have to select your targeted installation driver desk. In my case, I want to install this Firewalls on my external NVMe SSD. If you want to install any drive or disk, you can select here. Select your drive or disk. Now you'll have to select your EFA partition. Click on here and now you'll have to click this drive. Now from this drop down, select this option as recommended. Click on it. Click on install. Now you'll have to wait until installation is completed. Now, when the installation is completed, it will show installation is completed. Now, click on set down. Your PC will set down. Let's start your PC again. Now, in the screen, you will find the dual boot screen. If you select the first option, it will boot into Windows, and if you select FireOS, it will boot into FireOS. Select FireOS and hit the arrow key. Now, in the screen, you'll have to select FireOS multi install A and hit the energy. Now again, connect to internet, click on OK, click on get started, now accept terms and conditions, accept and continue. Now you will have to select your Pyros account or Google account, otherwise you can use local account. Click one of them and click on next, select for personal use, click on next, click on next, now, log in with your mail ID. Now, you will have to select your password. You can create one password for Firewall device or you can use your Gmail password to log in in Firewall. Select one of them and click on next. Here, you will have to choose your icon size and click on next. Here, you will have to choose the theme and click on next. Now, click on get started. Congratulations, Firewalls 19 has been successfully installed to your PC. Now, if you want to install Google Play Store on Firewalls, you can visit my channel and follow the Firewalls playlist. Thanks for watching.